You may or may not need to capture the VNC tower, but it does definitely make it a lot easier, at least I think, if you do. So let's take a look at our map and not take four fucking minutes to get to the point like this other guy did. Let's look at the garrison district over here. Zoom in right in between these two big buildings. This will look like a like an angled umbrella of some sort. The reason you want to go there is because it'll bring you here to the left once you capture that tower. Go up. You're going to want to make sure that you keep your accessories free of a couple of slots, at least if possible. It's very important because it's a little bit tricky. The broom automatically equips when your stamina is full. Call the elevator, by the way. This can actually take a good couple of minutes if it's all the way at the top. When you go in, not the basement, not ground level, not PK outpost. You want VNC tower roof. Go ahead and interact with that, and I'll see you in a moment when I reach the top, because it'll literally take a good minute or so. Three years later, when you reach the top, exit out. Go to the left. Now, hopefully I don't botch this, but if I do, it's not really a big deal. Just hear me out. Once you come right about here, you see that yellow crane? You're going to want to reach the very top of it, and you're going to see a gray box. Climb down to the little platform underneath it. It's got mushrooms, and you're just going to continuously click on it. What I'm hoping to do is not screw it up. Right there in the middle. You can't miss it. There's a little platform underneath. I almost had a heart attack. So right down here, this gray box. Now, when you see this, you're going to see a small mushroom, okay? You're going to hold the button down. And then the yellow bar is going to, like, spin around. It's going to take a while. And then more mushrooms are going to grow. You're going to repeat the process. This whole thing takes, like, three minutes. I'm not even making this up. Then when you're ready, it'll say this challenge can only be started during the night. Do you want to go to that day phase? You're going to start flying around on the broom. I don't want to do it because I already have the broom. And I don't know if that's going to, like break the exploit or the glitch or whatever, okay? As soon as you start flying around, simply quit out of the game. Literally, just quit out of the game. When you come back and you continue your game, you're going to end up coming back into the game in midair without the broom, and you'll have done this. You'll have splatted and died. Okay? Which is not a big deal. Here's where it gets a little bit interesting and a little bit confusing to explain, but I'm going to do my best to do so. Now, when you spawn here, you're going to want to go to your inventory, go to your accessories, 14 to 16, make sure it's not maxed out again. Pick on something you don't mind not using. For example, this, you could see, broom, equip. In the unlikely event that you have a message that it doesn't allow you to equip it and it just says drop drop one of these items so go back go to one of these things and drop it then go to it and equip it now when you go back and you go back i've equipped it but where's the where's the broom i'll show you where the broom is hold left on the d-pad to bring up the other items and you'll see broom night runner tool and then you'll start literally flying around the entire game for as much stamina as you have. I don't know, like, how far this actually works, but I think you can literally just go wherever the hell you want. And when you're done, you can't look at your map or anything. But it's, it's just a lot of fun. Like, this is so broken in so many good ways, and because I have so much stamina... I can just fly for a ridiculous amount of time. I'm going to hit the jump button. Oh, there you go. I'm going to hit the jump button. See my stamina? I'm good right now. But as soon as you hit your stamina full, it, you're going to launch again. So it's very dangerous. So this is where you go to the broom. And then you go and you select something else again. See how it says drop? 
This one says equip. They don't always all work. It's a little bit weird. If something doesn't work, drop an item. Just, you know what I mean? Play around with it. Don't freak out. It'll work. Now that I do that and it's no longer in my main list, I am now good. And now I get to uncover something that I don't even think I'd know how to get here on my own if it wasn't for using that broom. So that is some pretty wild stuff right there. And I'm just really excited I was able to show this to you because this video is four minutes. And guess what? The video that I saw the person explaining this took four minutes to begin explaining where you get the goddamn broom. The guy's got millions of subscribers, you know? What do I know how to run a, a YouTube channel? I'm just saying, though, man, that shit ain't cool. It really, really isn't. But unfortunately, you know, we've got people like that, and that's just the way it is. Oh, it's on that. Let's try this again. Let's go in that off section, click on one of the grenades, equip. Again, it may not work. Like I said, sometimes you got to, you know, drop an item, you know, that's in your list here if it doesn't allow you to equip it so that you have a free slot in here, right? You go back to seeing your character from here. You can drop these items here, right? You can't, whoops, well, whatever. When you're looking at all your items, you can't drop them from there. You got to drop it from the main character menu. So now I'm just, uh, we can even use the stamina. Oh, 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 okay. I was going to say, what's going on there? I thought I lost my broom for a minute there. But this is absolutely amazing. I can't even tell you how broken this is. And by doing a little bit of extra gameplay of me just kind of, you know, flying all over the place, it's, it's kind of proving to you that this thing isn't really limited except by by your stamina oh that's really cool again once my stamina is full right it's going to end up auto flying me you want to pick something up that you can equip and go back so that you can actually you know enjoy your time here, this is one of those things where you got to come back at night. But I, I I had never been here before. Like, I'd been in the area, but I was having a hard time trying to, you know, uncover this. And now I've got it uncovered. Anyways, like I said, I'm so, so excited about this. And I really hope that some people found this video, excuse me, helpful. And if you did, naturally... A like on the video does actually help promote the channel with the algorithm and making me a little bit more relevant in the search results when people are looking shit up. And if you didn't like the video, I mean, that's okay. No problem. No problem at all. Just go ahead, give it a thumbs down, and I'll just bonk this over your skull. And I'll break it off in your ass. And if you want to subscribe to the channel, I mean, naturally, that would be great now, wouldn't it? But if not, thanks for stopping by anyways. Take care. Maybe I'll see some of you in the next video. Now some bonus footage. No, actually, I don't want to do that. The video is already seven and a half minutes long now. It's going to take forever to, to compile on YouTube, right? So anyways, that's it for me. Until next time, bye for now.